Hi, this is Jeff Trotman. Today we're going to talk about Dynamics SL customization levels and how you can use those. We're going to start doing a very simple customization on the voucher and adjustment entry screen. Uh, notice there is no asterisk right there in the toolbar, uh, which means right now this screen is not customized. So we're going to go into Customize Mode, and I'm going to do a very simple customization that's just going to consist of adding a label to the screen. And because we're currently in self-customization mode, I'm going to let this label say self, and I'll explain a little bit more about that in just a second. So I'm going to drag it right there so we can see it a little bit better. I'm going to come out of customization mode, save my changes, and now I am going to close the screen and reopen it. And once the screen comes back up, you will see that we've got an asterisk in our window title now that indicates the screen is customized and you can see what I've done. Not very interesting but you get the point. Now I'm going to go into the administration menu and change my select customization level from self which is the default to all users and I'm going to click OK. I'm going to come back to the voucher and adjustment entry screen Notice self is not there and the asterisk is gone. I'll explain a little bit more about that in a second. Uh, but now I'm going to go in and I'm going to do another customization. And because I am in all user mode, I'm going to add another label. And this one I'm going to call all. And I'm going to drag it over here. Save my customization. and reopen the screen and now you'll see I've got an asterisk again I've got all I don't have my self label I'm going to close it again and I'm going to come to the select customization level and I'm going to change it back to self then I'm going to come open my screen again And now you'll notice I've got self and I've got all. The reason why is the customization levels are kind of like layers that can be applied. By default, uh, a user session is set to the self level. Uh, and every time if you exit and restart Solomon, you're going to be set to self unless you go into the select customization level and change it. The customization level not only defines what slot uh, a customization is saved when you go into Customization Manager and do the work, but that also defines how many, which layers are applied. So if I come in, and let me close this screen before I change this, if I go to Standard Mode, that says don't run any customizations. So when I do that and open my Voucher and Adjustment Entry, you can see I won't have my asterisk and I won't have either of my labels. This is a good way to test if you've got a customized screen and something is acting funny, uh, always run it in standard mode and that will let you know if the problem has to do with the customization you've done. Now if I come back and change my customization level to all user, that says apply the all user customization layer but don't apply anything below that. So when I open my screen, you can see I've got the all, which tells us our all user customization is loaded, but my self customization is not loaded. I'm not going to go into each individual level, but each one of these is layered on top of that. So when you do self, you can actually have an all user, a one group, a one user, and a self. And when you're in the self customization level, all of those layers are loaded. As you can see, once we go back to self, the voucher and adjustment entry screen has both the all and the self. Thanks for watching. Hopefully that helps. Uh, for more information, visit my blog at wisdomofsolomon.wordpress.com.